Hi everybody, it's Gina and I'm back with another quick video. And what I wanted to do today was to show you how you can recycle your egg, your egg containers and use them as mini greenhouses to start your seedlings. So what I have here is just one that I had saved. And you can see that I've put some holes into the bottom that's purely for, for drainage. Now let me show you an example that's been filled with soil. Once you have the holes punched, you simply fill your container with soil and you plant your seeds at the appropriate depths. This one has uh, green beans in them. It's really easy to write on the styrofoam containers or on the paper ones if you choose to use the paper. So you can identify what's inside. But in here are some green beans and there's one in each section and uh, in a few days I should be seeing seedlings pop through. I chose to keep the covers on because once you close them and you set this in a sunny location this becomes like a greenhouse effect or becomes like a mini greenhouse and within a few days you should have seedlings popping through. Now these were planted on Saturday they haven't quite popped through yet but let me show you some that were planted last Friday. These are yellow beans. These were planted last Friday and today's Wednesday. So you're looking at about four to five days. And what you have in here, you can see all of the, the new seedlings that are working their way through the soil. They're not quite ready for me to keep it open. So, and the soil is still nice and moist. So once you have it watered and, the, and you have it covered, you simply just go ahead and close it. Now those are the yellow beans. Let me show you a few others that I have started. This is kohlrabi, which is a German vegetable very similar to potato. And uh, you can see these are very tiny seeds to begin with. But you can see that there's several of them and I put one tiny seed into each section. And some of these are, are quite tall already. So what I'm going to have to do within the next day or so is cut off the cover and simply place that underneath and use it um, maybe to collect drainage or to add a little bit more water. It can also act as a self-watering device. So you can see the kohlrabi seedlings that are coming up. So go ahead and close that back and let me show you one more. These are snow peas that were also planted last Friday and uh, one of them is already so big that it's the leaves are beginning to be bent down by the cover. So I may have to go ahead and simply cut that off and the others are going to be growing rather quickly. So that's just an easy way to recycle your egg cartons and use as mini greenhouses. I'm gonna go ahead and cut this off to show you how easy that is. And then what I'm gonna do is just turn it over so that it can be used as a self-watering. Okay, now that that's been removed, you simply lift this up, put water at the bottom, place this into here, and you can water your plants without damaging your seedlings whatsoever. So that's just a really easy way of recycling your containers using, uh, recycling your um, egg cartons and using them as a little seedling starters. Now here's one that I used to start some sorrel plants and a few of these have already been transplanted because you can see that they're getting quite tall. So these two are not quite ready to be transplanted yet but once I lift this up, once I'm ready to transplant, all I have to do is pull this apart and you'll be able to see the root ball in there and I just put that into a bigger container. Well I hope that you have been inspired to reuse your egg cartons rather than throwing them into the recycling bin or some other trash trash receptacle. This is a very easy way to reuse them to get your seedlings started. And um, go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you learned something from this video. If you're <laughs>